to You Bet Your Ass. Please welcome your host, Stuart Francis. Hello. Hello and welcome to You Bet Your Ass. I'm Stuart Francis of Poor Man's Harrison Ford. But it's not all about me. Let me introduce you to my co-host. She's a woman with the nicest entrance in all of show business. Please welcome the lovely Satara. Hello, Hubba, Hubba Satara. You look lovely. Oh, thank you, and so do you, Stuart. What do you? Oh, the contestants. Right, we've got uh, AJ. Bubba and Mr. You guys sound like a boy band from like Alabama. And hey, I can't wait know? to uh, not buy your album. Okay, Stuart, why don't we just start the game? I know what these contestants want. They want a piece of ass. All right, contestants, get ready. In this round, questions are worth 100 points, unless you want to double down, making them worth 200 points, but you will have to get both questions right. If you get it wrong, someone else could buzz in and steal it from you. Keep your eyes out for the wild card. That is your chance to steal 500 points from another competitor, and you each get 1,000 points to start. Stuart? Thank you, Sitara. We determined backstage who goes first by the person who could correctly guess the number of Savage Garden songs I know the words to. With all of them, AJ, you're up first. To Terry Cola, hit me! Freaky Daves! AJ, I ask you, single or doubling down? Uh, I'm gonna double down. Doubling down! Definitely double down. On Freaky Daves. Good luck, AJ. First question What American illusionist stunts included being buried, frozen, and living underwater? Correct answer is? Um. Oh, I know this. Ba Baba. David Blaine. David Blaine. Booyah! Yeah! Now you have to get the second question right oh, yeah. uh, to get all, them, right, uh, all right, the I points the there. Uh, here we go. Good luck, Bubba. What Wild at Heart director makes it hard for us to eat popcorn due to his obsession with traumatic head injuries and deformities? Correct answer is? <laughs> Man, I'm stumped. Not such a smart ass now, are we, Bubba? No, apparently not. No, it's uh, David Lynch, but it's your category. Hit me! Jumpin' Jack Flash. What do you say, Bubba? Just let's just let's play it safe right now. Right? You know, single. Yeah, single. Jumpin' right. Jack Flash. What Hawaiian beach bum busted out songs for the film Curious George? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, buzzing in, Mister. It's Jack Johnson. Jack Johnson's right. Well done, Mister. And it's Mister's category. Hit me. Cheers. Single or doubling down? Double down. Doubling down on Double cheers. Down. What actor got to throw a few knuckleballs at the ladies as barman Sam Malone? Oh, what's his name? What's his name? I can't tell you. I cannot tell you. <laughs> Anyone? AJ? Bubba? No, man, I'm stumped. Ted Danson. Oh, shoot, for sure. I know. We all feel stupid. AJ, yeah. let's get you a category. Right. Hit me. <laughs> wild card! Oh. What happens in a wild card, Chitara? Well, when the wild card appears, that's your chance to steal 500 points from a competitor of your choice. So who's it going to be? Baba. Mister. Say Baba. 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 Mister. Definitely Baba. Mister. Mister? Yeah, oh, Mister. he's got more points. I guess it makes sense. OK, AJ. The topic is, where did I get drunk? I took a tour of a Guinness brewery, slugged back pints at the Temple Bar, and barfed on a statue of James Joyce. Where did I get drunk? Ireland? Or more specifically, Dublin? Correct. Well done. Thanks for the specifics. Well done, AJ. Bubba, it's your category. Hit me. Unplugged, Bubba. We wish you were, but what's your uh, choice? Single or doubling down? I think I'm going to have to double it, my good man. <laughs> you don't know that. Doubling down. And the first question is Liam Gallagher sat in the rafters and heckled what band's unplugged performance? <laughs> AJ? Blur. No. It was his own band, Oasis. <laughs> no more bets. That's the end of the round. Sitara. Well, that is the end of the round, and wow, AJ has the lead. He's got 1,100 points so far, Bubba with 500, and Mr. with only 400. But if you like it dirty, you will love our next round. Stick around. Welcome back to You Bet Your Ass. This might not be the right place or the right time. Will you marry me, Sitara? Um, no, Stuart, but I will introduce the next round. How about that? It's uh, sort of like 
12 spitballs from an old baseball player. Yeah, it's the Dirty Dozen. <laughs> In this round, the contestants will be randomly asked four different questions each. And when the spotlight stops on you, it's your turn to answer, so pay attention, okay? And each question is worth 500 points, and you don't lose points for wrong answers. Stuart? Let's do this thing. <laughs> what Mac partner with Ben Affleck to write the smarmy Goodwill Hunting? Mr. Matt Damon. Matt Damon's correct. A Ferengi Damon would be found in what sci-fi TV series? Bubba. Um, I'm nice try. <laughs> Star Trek. True or false, Star Trek was created by sci-fi geek L. Ron Hubbard. False. AJ, false. wait for your answer. AJ. False. A okay, we got it. Well done, that's right. Hopefully we learned our lesson there. L. Ron Hubbard started what trendy fake religion? Mr. Scientology. Correct. Scientology has what Top Gun Yahoo as a member? Mr. Uh, Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise is right. Well done. Last minute, last minute. A cruise missile is capable of carrying what kind of deadly warhead? Bubba. Atomic bomb. Uh, Missile? We'll take that. Oh, yeah. Don't get upset at Woo! us. We We're hoping for a <laughs> nuclear on that, but we'll take all those words you said. Nuclear safety inspector is a title held by what hilarious TV dad? AJ. Mr. Homer Simpson. Mr. Homer Simpson's <laughs> correct. Well done, AJ. True or false? Homer has only three hairs on his head. Bubba, wait for your Sorry, name. My bad. False. Bubba, that's right. No, it's, uh, yeah, you're right. With false. Two. two. We're here to have fun, Bubba, please. Bald eagles are recognized as the bird of what pushy nation? Mr. America. USA or America? True or false? America was named after Gino explorer Amerigo Vespucci. AJ. True. <laughs> that's right. Well done. Poochie was a lame skateboarding dog on what cartoon series? Bubba. Poochie. Oh, man. The Simpsons. Last question. True or false? The Simpsons is the longest running American sitcom. AJ. True. True is right. Well done. Thanks for waiting, AJ. Over to you, Satara. Wow, AJ has got a narrow lead right now over Mr. Him with 3,100 points. With 2400. Bubba's trailing a little with 1500, but that could all change because now we're going to double your pleasure and double your fun. It's time to play Up Your Ass. This is our third round. It's kind of similar to the first round, except the point values double. That's right, each question is now worth 200, or you can double down for 400, and you each get a thousand points to continue. Good luck. Thank you, Satara. Bubba, amongst other things, you were trailing in that round. <laughs> Let's get you a category. Hit me! <laughs> Family ties. What would you like to do, Bubba? Single or double down? I'm playing it safe right now. I'm just gonna do single my dinner. Single to Bubba. Yeah. Here we go. Family ties. What was the surname of the family in Family Ties who combined socialism, capitalism, and hilarity? What are the Smiths? I've never even seen the show. I don't know, man. Easy job. Kazoo <laughs> type. Mister, it's all happening. The Keaton? The Keaton family, correct. Well done. Let's get you a category as well, mister. Hit me. Faulty. Single or doubling down? Uh, Don't look double. at Bubba's friends. They won't help you. I got to double. <laughs> You're doubling down. Here we go. First question, mister. What comedian slayed us with his deadpan funny as the star of the BBC series Faulty Towers? Oh, um, can... No. AJ, Bubba? No. Nope. Candy. John Cleese. Mr. or AJ, let's get you a category. Hit me. Ones, twos, and trees. I'm gonna play what would safe. you like to do? Play it safe? Yeah, Just a single, AJ? Play Here we safe. go. What type of tree did Homer Simpson crash his car into while mimicking the Flintstones in the classic episode of The Simpsons? 
He's I'm about to hit a chestnut tree. Chestnut tree. Well <laughs> done, AJ. Let's get Bubba category. Hit me. Stick it to me. Bubba. Single. Double it. Double and down. Double down, baby. There we go. First question. What Chinese needle treatment makes its patients look like a porcupine? What is acupuncture? What is acupuncture? When you, when you get a right answer, you really jump all over, don't you? <laughs> Here's your second question. You got points on that one. Oh, man. You caught the crowd off guard by getting a right answer. Well, well, who would have thought? Who would have thought being blonde would have an answer up here? Here's your huh? second question. You can shut up an old lady by giving her needles and yarn for what geriatric pastime? The correct answer is? Knitting. Knitting is right. Well done, you. <laughs> Bubba, now it's Mr. Let's get you a category. Hit me. <laughs> Fictional cripples. <laughs> <laughs> a feel good category. What would you like to do, my friend? Single or double down? I'm going to double. Doubling down on the cripple. Here we go. Good luck to you, my friend. If Scrooge hadn't become such a softy, what gimpy boy had it coming to him in Dickens' A Christmas Carol? Uh, poor little Timmy. <laughs> no, it's Tiny Tim. Oh. I know, I'm sorry. Let's get AJ a category. They're turning on us, AJ. Hit me! <laughs> Healthy lungs. What would you like to do, my friend? Single or double down? Uh, I'm a smoker, so I'm going to single. 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 single because place. you're a smoker. Yeah, you don't know anything much. about healthy no, lungs. That's really. what you're saying. Okay, no. got you. <laughs> She made us feel with the emancipation of Mimi and made us cringe in glitter. Who is she? Mariah Carey. Well done, AJ. <laughs> Bubba's all pissed off. Bubba, let's get you a simple category. Hit me. <laughs> For the birds, perfect. What would you like to do? Single or doubling down? Well, you know what? I'm behind, so we may as well just double it. Absolutely. It gets you off the show quicker. Here we go. What aquatic bird tastes great a la orange? A la orange. A la orange. A la orange. <laughs> Oh my God. Get ready with those buzzers, Hang boy. On, I don't know. No. Mister. Duck. Duck is right. Well done. Yeah, mister. Now you have to, yeah. since it's a double down and you stole, you have to get the second question right. So here it is. What scavenging bird is likely to hover above you as you starve to death in the Nevada desert? Oh, that is, it looks like a, it's a vulture. Vulture's right. Well done, mister. And it's your category. Hit me. Poker hands. What would you like to do? Single or double down? Double, double down. Doubling down. Poker hands. Here we go. Good luck, mister. You'll get a rocket in your pocket if you're dealt pocket rockets or what two cards? Two aces. Two aces is right. Well done. Again, second question. You have to get this right to get the points. In one of many homophobic poker terms, what card do you pair with? Uh, a queen to make a San Francisco busboy. <laughs> Bubba knows. <laughs> Two queens? You would have thought, but no, a three. Ah. And that's the end of the round. No more bets, Satara. Well, it looks like AJ is hanging on to that lead spot. He's got 4,500 points. Bubba's got 2,300 and Mr. with 2,800. And after the break, we are going to be left with one winner and two losers. So find out who's who when we come back. Welcome back to you, Bet Your Ass, or as it's known today, The Bubba Show. Satara, <laughs> what's up next? Well, Stuart, now, contestants, you must put your money where your mouth is. It's time to play ass on the line. Okay, this is our final round. Contestants will be given a category of their choice with three different questions in each. They must wager some of their points on each question with a minimum of 500 points a bet. The contestant with the most points at the end of the round will win. Let's find out who it is. Stuart? Thank you, Satara. Baba, my little snow pea, you're trailing right now, so let's get you a category to choose from. Let's have a look at them, please. Wes Anderson, fictional sports, software. Dude, where's my car? What's it going to be, Baba? I think I'm going to have to go for, dude, where's my car? I thought as much. Now, Baba, you have 2,300 points. AJ has 4,500 points. What would you like to wager on this, your first question? Over a thousand. A thousand points. Good luck, Baba. I parked my Astro van somewhere near Dolphin Stadium in South Beach. I like looking at bikinis, but I should find my kids. Dude, where's my car? Miami. Miami's right. Well done, Baba. 
He got 3,300 points. AJ's got 4,500. What's it going to be on this second question, my friend? A thousand dollars. A thousand, thousand points. Thousand points. Here we go. I ditched my Chevette near something called the Parthenon and woke up in a country with souvlaki on my breath. Dude, where's my car? Greece. Athens, Greece. Well done. 4,300 points to AJ's 4,500 points. Your last question. Bubba, I ask you, what are you doing? 4,300, baby. The, oh, yeah. Good luck, Bubba. It's all in or go home, man. Okay, get ready to go home. Here we go. I took my DeLorean back in time and landed on some pilgrim boat leaving Plymouth in 1620. And I left it there. Dude, where's my car? Oh, I'm going home. See ya, ladies oh. and gentlemen. I don't know. On the Mayflower, Baba. It's Mr.'s turn. Mr., what of the three categories would you like to choose from? I'm going to go with fictional sports. Fictional sports. Now, you've got 2,800 to AJ's 4,500. What would you like to wager on this, your first question? Uh, I think I'm going to take an easy 500. An easy 500. Okay. Quaffles, Bloodgers, Snitches, and Harry Potter getting hammered off his broomstick are a part of what fictional sport? Uh, lacrosse. Quidditch. Quidditch, I don't know either. No, I don't know what they're laughing at. You've got 2,300 points to AJ's 4,500 points. What would you like to wager? I owe 1,000. 1,000 points. Here we go. A delinquent boy and his stuffed tiger use a volleyball, wickets, masks, and changing rules in what comic book game? Winnie the Pooh? No. <laughs> Calvin Ball. I'm so sorry, mister. You got 1,300 points. I go all, all of it. Yeah. Here we go. Good luck, mister. Trey Parker and Matt Stone turned beer guzzling men into star athletes by inventing what sport in a 1998 comedy of the same name? Uh, basketball? Uh... That's your answer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you want to change it? No, the right that's answer fine. Or something else? You got basketball. Well done. AJ, it is your category. Software or Wes Anderson? What's going to be, AJ? Uh, software, please. Okay. What are you going to wager on this year's first question? Min minimum, of course. <laughs> 500. Okay. Here we go. What popular Adobe program do computer nerds use to manipulate pictures so it appears they have friends? Uh, I believe that's Photoshop. You're right. Well done, AJ. <laughs> Baba, Mr. Start getting your belongings. I think you're, uh, yeah. Here we go, second question. What are you gonna wager on this, uh, Minimum again. What digital media player by Apple Computer allows you to organize and play all your illegal music? Oh, my favorite device in the world, an iPod. Judges? <laughs> no. <laughs> iTunes. I don't know iTunes. why they're laughing, you're the winner. AJ, your last question. What's it gonna I be? Know, I don't know either, Stuart. Yeah. <laughs> Minimum 500. 500 points, here we go, AJ. What Microsoft spreadsheet program allows you to keep track of how much money the government takes from you each year? Microsoft Excel. Correct. Well done, AJ. You are our champion. You won $500. Baba, Mr. you guys have been fantastic, uh, fantastic contestants. Please leave. Sitara. Well, yes, AJ did pretty well. He won that round pretty easily. But our bonus round is not so easy, and it's worth $2,000. We'll see how AJ does after the break. Welcome back to you, Bet Your Ass. What a great round we had today. A great game. Our champion sits here. AJ, you won $500, my friend. Congratulations. Congratulations. But a certain sexy safekeeper is going to try to tempt you to win even more cash. Please welcome back to the stage, Satara. Okay, AJ, you have won $500, but you think anyone can win $500 on You Bet Your Ass. Now we're going to find out what you're really made of. I'm going to give you a chance to win $1,000 for one question or double down $2,000 for two questions. What's it going to be? What do you think you should do, audience? What do you think? You, you know, I played it kind of safe this whole game, and I think this is the time to get kind of reckless now. What's that so, mean? Uh, He's doubling down. What does that mean? Stuart, I'm going to double yes. down. Yes, very yeah. exciting. Good luck, He's doing it. Great. Good luck, AJ. Good luck, you, my friend. Let's get you a category. Hit me. Boy, what a band. We, we launched our lunch when MTV series Making the Band launched what pop act in 2000? 
O-Town. O-Town was the right answer, but AJ is our winner. He won $500. I'm Stuart Francis. Will Bubba be waiting for me in the parking lot? You bet your ass he will. Good night, everyone. <laughs>